Hi, I'm Viral Shah, co-founder and CEO of Julia Hub and one of the creators of the Julia programming language. This, uh, this February 14th on Valentine's Day, it's going to be 11 years since we first published our blog on Why Julia. And we started with this bold vision about how Julia is gonna solve the two language problem. I think we've got there, although we have a long way to go over the last 10 years, Julia's got 8,000 packages. It's got a million users. It, the kinds of applications have been amazing from drug discovery to space missions. Um, to, you know, to, to all kinds of amazing scientific applications. I'm Jeff Bizanson. Uh, thank you for your interest in the Julia language. So I feel very lucky to still be doing this 11 years later. Uh, I'm, I'm really glad. It's really exceeded my wildest dreams that I could be doing this this long, and I hope to keep doing it. Uh, so I'm, I'm grateful to everyone who's involved for that. Hi, my name is Kano Fisher. I am uh, CTO and one of the co-founders here at Julia Hub. Hi, I'm Alan Edelman. I'm the Chief Technical Officer over at Julia Hub. I also have a day job. I'm a professor of applied mathematics over at MIT. So I'm very excited about how far Julia has come in the last 11 years and, and even more so. So uh, I'm very excited to see that people are using Julia all over the place over at MIT. What's really fun for me to see is sometimes uh, I'll find out that people are using Julia on the other side of my office, right on the other side of the wall. And um, I won't even know about it for several years. It is really hard to believe uh, that it's been 11 years since we published the blog post about why we created Julia. And of course, uh, we had already been working on it for several years at that point. Um, I was at the time that I wrote that blog, uh, I was in in... Argentina, Buenos Aires. I was on vacation for a month there with some friends, hanging out in cafes and doodling in notebooks. And I, I had the the inspiration struck me to to write this blog post about our inspiration and how we really wanted the best of all possible combinal combinations of all the tools that we've used in the past um, that we that we love and then sometimes are frustrated with. And Julia is our attempt to to make something that's uh, you know, the best of all worlds. A fun fact about me is that I have a corgi, a dog named Philip. Uh, Philip comes to the classes with me all of the time. In fact, on the first day of classes, I'll write on the blackboard so the students know what, so that the students know they're in the right place. I'll write Professor Alan Edelman and Professor Philip the Corgi. Uh, and um, one fun fact about me is uh, that I used to do competitive ballroom dancing in college, and uh, I am still a quite active dancer in a number of styles. Uh, I dance salsa, I dance bachata, I dance Brazilian zouk, um, and you know it's uh, one of my great passions in life, other than uh, making compilers faster. By the way, uh, in two thousand six. I set the Guinness World Record for traversing the entire New York City subway system in the shortest time, stopping at every station with uh, some of my friends that I'd gone to high school with. In our Boston office, uh, we have a lot of our remote colleagues visiting. Uh, and the highlight of the week for me was that I cooked dinner for everybody last night. A fun fact about me, when you won't find me at my desk programming, I'm probably out playing Ultimate Frisbee or swimming. <laughs>